News. And we are following breaking news this afternoon. A death investigation is underway in Council Bluffs. Investigators are near the area of Landstrom and Gray Streets. KMTV Action 3 News reporter Jake Wazikowski is live from Council Bluffs and has the latest information. Jake. Mandy and I did just talk to Council Bluff Sergeant Myers about this death investigation. They are not confirming any homicide, but are saying that there is a death investigation going on behind me, which is just north of Langstrom Avenue on Gray Street, you're just a little bit south of Canesville Boulevard, where they say two people are confirmed dead inside a home. Let me step out of the shot here and uh, let you take a look closer. Uh, a number of police officers, including investigators, are on the scene right now. They have been waiting to get a search warrant to head inside the home. Uh, what we do know so far is that the call came in by a family member at about 10 a.m. to the police department and so far as we mentioned, only would say that it is a death investigation. Two people inside. It's unclear of their age or gender right now. They haven't identified anyone yet either as to if there are any suspects out there as well. But we did talk to a neighbor who said that uh, an elderly woman lived at that home and maybe some of her, maybe her daughter and maybe a grandson may have moved in recently. Let's go ahead and hear from her. I had heard her daughter and her son moved in, and I know they've had problems with him. What kind of problems have they had with him? Or do you I know? think he's been in correctional. He's really spooky looking. And we talked to other neighbors and people in the area who said it's a pretty quiet area. There is a lot of traffic, but still pretty quiet in this hilly neighborhood in Council Bluffs. But nothing, anything like this ever really happens. We did see County Attorney Matt Wilbur show up on scene a short time ago. But again, uh, so far what we know is that there is a death investigation. Two people found dead inside a home just up the hill from here on Gray Street, just south of Langstrom. And it's between Canesville Boulevard as well. Uh, it's probably about a half mile from Canesville, as I can see it in the background as we are up in the bluffs here. Reporting live from Council Bluffs, we'll have much more coming up, hopefully later in the show and later in our other shows. Reporting live from Council Bluffs, Jake Wasikowski, KMTV Action 3 News. Jake.